praise the Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Welcome to church. Glory to God. I'd like to take this glorious opportunity to thank the gift of God to us and to the nations of the world. This is none other than our man of God, Pastor Denis Amos Amajong, and our mom, Pastor Anne. I appreciate them so much for giving us the supernatural word for the day every day. Today is Friday, the 11th of June, the year 2021. The word for today says intercession for the lost. Intercession for the lost. Glory to God. The word for today is from the book of Ezekiel, chapter 22, verse 30. And the Bible says, And I sought for a man among them that should make up the hedge and stand in the gap before me for the land that I should not destroy it. Hallelujah. A dear man of God, Pastor Denison, shares with us in the supernatural word for today saying, Intercession is praying on behalf of someone. When you take up the ministry of intercession, you are siding with God as a laborer in the kingdom. You're working with him to improve and impact the lives of others. Hallelujah. Jesus said in the book of Matthew chapter 9 verse 37, The harvest is plenty, but the laborers are few. Hallelujah. However, as we know that the spirit world influences the natural, likewise, responding to the gift of salvation is best influenced through, through prayer. Hallelujah. Likewise, responding to the gift of salvation is best influenced through prayer. A man of God, Pastor Denison, makes additional emphasis saying, God needs Christians to labor in prayer for the souls of men. Be that man or woman that is found to stand in the gap, to pray for people to come to Christ, or praying for fellow Christians and ministers of the gospel to fulfill their call and destinies in the gospel. As children of God, it's your responsibility to push back the forces of darkness in our land. When we pray for everyone in our nation, there are increased activities of righteousness. The presence of God mantles men's hearts and God's word prevails in their lives. Hallelujah. Glory to God. A man of God, Pastor Dennis, then concludes the supernatural word for today saying, The Lord has called all Christians into the ministry of intercession for the lost people of the world. Is not looking for perfect prayer warriors, but willing hearts who want to see his will come to pass on the earth. Are you one of the willing hearts? Hallelujah. Turn to the Lord in prayer immediately. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Our first meditation scripture for today is from the book of 2 Chronicles, chapter 7, verse 14. The book of 2 Chronicles, chapter 7, verse 14. And the Bible says, If my people, which are called by my name, shall humble themselves and pray, and seek my face, and turn from the wicked ways. Then will I hear from heaven, and will forgive their sins, and will heal their land. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Our second meditation scriptures from the book of 1 Timothy chapter 2, verses 1 through 2. And the Bible says, I exhort therefore, that first of all, supplications, prayers, intercessions, and giving of thanks be made for all men, for kings and for all that are in authority, that we may lead a quiet and peaceable life in all godliness and honesty. Hallelujah. Glory to God. We'd like to appreciate our Father, a man of God, Pastor Dennis, for giving us the one-year Bible reading plan. And today we are reading the book of 2 Samuel, chapters 21 through 22, and the book of John, chapter 11. Glory to God. Now let's proceed to our prophetic declaration for today. 
I request you lift up your holy hands and say these words in power. Say, Dear Father, your grace that brings salvation has been made available to all men. Therefore, I pray for sinners around the world that their hearts be open to receive the gospel. I break Satan's hold on people's minds so that the light of the glorious gospel of Christ would shine into them for salvation. In Jesus' name, Amen. Now let's go on to meditate on these words by speaking in other tongues. Libra la stole kele baradi, manto kaliga brade, rika pradiga sante kula baboria, mando zelo kradiga paratia, jete kete liga stole di karuda diga mando, li prado karatia, le frekeli karatige bozante el poder. In Jesus' name, shout amen.